Don't let me go, please. Shut up, shut up. Get the wheel. There are two things I want to hear from you. Good luck and goodbye. And that's it. That's all. Please, don't do this. Please don't. Laura, what do you want? You want us to be killed? You want us to both die? Is that it? You're not a stupid woman. You're not. You get on the bus, you don't talk to anybody. When you get to Port Charles, you call Joe Kelly. <laughs> call Joe Kelly. You tell him to take care. <laughs> to take care of you. If I get into trouble, I'm, 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 I'm going to mail him to Black Book if I get into trouble. Tell him, tell him to watch the mail. No, don't do this, please. Shut call up, please. Don't, don't, no, don't, don't make this hard on me. When am I going to see you again? Soon, baby. Are you sure? Soon. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. you been? What is going on? And where is Lucy? Look, I'm sorry it took so long. Lucy sprained her ankle. Well, where is she? service here, bud? Yes, sir. Why can't I do a beer? Beer? Uh, beer? You got any pretzels? No. Eat the nuts, all right? You got a beer. Coming right up. Here you go. I'm sorry, So where Sal. is she? Look, I'm sorry. What happened is she sprained her ankle. I had to take her to the clinic. What clinic? There's a clinic about three, four blocks away. I took her there. And uh, uh, there were a lot of people in line. Her, her ankle was swelling up already. Uh, and so I took her there. There's a lot of people in line. She may not be back real soon. Can I help you, sir? I have been waiting. I, I'm real sorry. We had a problem with the ice machine. What would you like? Uh, I'd like a vodka on the rocks. You got it. OK? Got it. Where's the vodka? There we are. Sally, look, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. And I, I really don't know that uh, Lucy's going to be back in time to work tonight. But you can fill in for us, can't you? Well, I guess I can, but I'm not even changed yet. Well, maybe uh, Hutch can help then. Here you go, sir. Sorry about all that ice, but it'll be nice and cold for you. All right? Thanks. You got it. Where is Hutch? I don't know. He disappeared, too. He did. Great. Would you all like to pay up right now? I'll start a tap for me, please. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry that won't be possible. You see, I'm on all alone tonight. Uh, somebody got sick. It looks like we're going to have a big crowd. Uh, I think it'd be better if you just paid as we went. Sure. Anything to keep management happy. Thank you. Do no, hey, you so guys hard. ever think about no. keeping the customer happy? Well, look, I don't want to push you or anything. It's just that I think it would be better for you if you paid up as we went. Otherwise... Let me just get my change. You got your change. Thank you very much. I'll take that. Sally, I'm on top of it. I'm on top of it. All I, all, all, all I need to do is, uh, is, is take care of the customers here. Look, you know, the ice and everything. Oh, hello. Sally, would you show her to her regular table? <laughs> Thanks. This is the owner of the place, you know. Hi. Thank you very much. Thank 
already and it looks like we're gonna have a big night we're gonna have a lot of customers i better go get some more ice we're gonna have a lot of customers tonight <laughs> that's exactly why you're gonna stay put right here you're not going anyplace well uh sure so if that's what you want that's exactly what i want the customer's gonna get warm drinks that's now. fine you got it okay you got it you guys okay yeah. everybody here okay yeah <laughs> My dear. Where are we having dinner? Well, you always like the floating rib. Great. Shall we go? Oh, just one more thing. You remember that trip to Europe I've been promising you? And promising, and promising, <laughs> and promising. Well, it may become reality, but if it does, it may be sudden, and you'll have to pack in a hurry. We'll go on the yacht to begin with, at least. Okay. I don't want you to mention to anyone that we may be leaving. All right. I think I understand. That's the way it has to be. I'm sure the car's waiting, shall we? Smith leaves the property, the power goes off too. Do you have your flashlight? Think about that. And don't get nervous. Don't panic. Whatever you do, just leave the message. The man is to call Smith. It's urgent. It's about Luke and Laura. Three rings. Four rings. Okay, just hang up on that one. Here, let me take this and take a look. Just proud. We're going to have time to call these numbers. Well, yeah, Leslie seems to think Smith will stay there long enough, and, uh, I guess we're just going to have to trust Leslie to come up with something if Smith decides to mess us up. Here. You know, it's kind of funny to think a birthday party could be keeping my brother from getting killed. Come on, make the call. You've got to help me. Please help me. Of course I will. Where is Luke? Where is he? You tell me. I, I don't know. I don't know. All I know is that he's going to take hold the black book. What do you mean? Well, I, I don't know what happened this afternoon, but he, he said that he found the left-handed boy and that he could decode the black book, but he's acting crazy. Just... All right, in what way? 
I don't know. He wants to do it all by himself or something. But we've got to stop him because he's in a lot of danger. He, he slapped me. How did she have never slapped me? Well, that's not like Luke at all, is it? No. No. But, but we've got to find him because he's in a lot of danger. He put me on a bus to Port Charles. I got off as soon as I can. Now he's he's going to get himself killed. I know he's going right. to get himself killed. Okay, not if I can help. Right. What are we going to do? Okay, just calm down. Let's Have think about... Have you seen him? Not, not for a while. Let's think about this rationally, all right? You say Luke says he knows about the left-handed boy and he can decode that book. That's right. All right, there's only one thing it could be. It means he's going to meet with the left-handed boy sooner than midnight. I don't know. I guess that could be it. Okay, and there's only one place that could be. Where? In the magic shop. It all tied into that somewhere. Well, how are we going to get in there? All right. Don't worry about that. I think uh, Luke's already in there waiting. All right, listen, when we go in, I want you to stay behind me. I don't want you to get hurt. If anything happens to you, Luke's going to be all over me. Okay? Come on. Once they understand it, the cops are on it, they'll be willing to back off, I'm pretty sure. You know, I'd feel a lot better if there wasn't any electricity in this place. Yeah. Look, the, uh, the power box is probably down in the basement. I think I can probably put it out of commission for some time to come. Now listen, Smith and Jennifer are probably arriving at the party right about now. Yeah. Yeah, maybe uh, Jennifer won't be the only one to be surprised tonight. Sorry? Oh, yes, yes, he is. Uh, uh, oh, he, he just stepped out on, on the patio. Can I take a message? Oh, I see. Right. Of course I'll tell him. Okay, goodbye. What, what, what? Uh, it was someone for Mr. Smith. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? what? Saying that electric power is off at his house. No. And that the security system is not working. Good. I'm, What's good about it? Um, just, that's fine. Thank you, Harry. Now, Leslie, look. I know I agreed to help you, but this is serious. I said there's no electrical power in this house. Howard, we made a bargain. You tell anybody, and so help me, I'll beat you up myself. Leslie, I just wish I knew what this was all about and why I'm doing this. I'll explain it to you as soon as I can. Just know right now, I'm helping save my daughter's life. Luke. Go ahead. What if the left-handed boy is in here? It's okay. I'm judge anybody could be in here. If we weren't alone by now, we'd know it. Well, then how did you get in here so easily? I just shoved open the door. Came open. Luke? 
Luke, are you in here? Luke's not here, Laura. I guess not. I imagine he's at the bar. Well, then I don't understand. Why did we come here? To get what I want. What? Hold still. Shut up and hold still. Now, we're going to call Luke. But you're not going to see your lover again unless he gives me the gold. Mm -hmm. 